Hi, grade twos. So today you are learning to use the count on strategy to add. So first you're gonna to need to review what does addition mean? So there's a video for you to watch on the Google Slides and then once you're finished watching that, you can talk with a grown up or someone who's with you and what does it mean? So once you've watched it, you'll remember that adding means you have more. So you're taking two numbers and putting them together so you have a bigger number or more things. So today we're learning about count on swan. So count on swan tells us to put the largest number in our head and count on. So it's a really good strategy when you have equations with plus one, plus two, plus three, and plus four, okay? So for example, we have nine. So I'm just gonna use my highlighter here and I'm gonna highlight the bigger number. Can you tell me what the bigger number is? Is it nine or three? It's nine, that's right. So I'm gonna put that number in my head, boop, in my head, and count on three times. So I put nine in my head, and then I use my fingers to keep track. So nine, 10, 11, 12. So nine plus three equals 12. So let's do some practice. I'm just gonna move my face over here. So start with the biggest number and count on from whatever the second number says. So I'm gonna just use a circle. Do -do. Oops. Okay. So we'll use this to keep track and maybe we'll make it a different color. Mm, we just want a different line color. There we go. Line color red. There we go. That's better. Delete the black one. Okay. So we have four plus two. So which one's the bigger number grade twos? Four. That's right. So I'm going to find four in my hundreds chart or put four in my head and then count on how many times how many times am i counting on two times that's maybe that's confusing because i highlighted the bigger number before so bigger number is four and then count on with a different color count on two times okay so you're ready to do that with me four oh, i need my pen five six so four five six so four plus two is six okay let's try another one i'm gonna take my circle back so this is my next question three plus six which one's the bigger number i'm gonna highlight it in yellow the bigger number is six that's right oops I want that. there we go six Okay, so I'm gonna put my circle on six. And remember, if you have a hundreds chart, if you don't need that to help you, don't need to use it. Um, I like to just use my head and my fingers to help me. Um, but you might need the hundreds chart, which is totally fine. Okay, and then we're gonna count up three times. So let's do that. Three or six, oops, seven, eight, nine, or six, seven, eight, nine. So I counted up three times. Three plus six equals nine. Okay, let's do another question. And here I have a um, number line to help me. So maybe a hundred chart is a bit too big or a little overwhelming for you can use a number chart. I'm going to steal this red dot back. Oops. How do I... copy there we go okay so let's look at two plus four which one's the bigger number let's highlight the bigger number in yellow is four that's right okay so this time i'm going to use the um number line okay um then we're going to count up how many times count on two times that's right okay let's use the pen four five, six, so you put four in your head, five, six, so two plus four is six. Good job. Now three plus five. First of all, which one's the bigger number? Five, oops. Five, you got it. And then the smaller number is three, so that's what we're counting on by. So we're gonna put our dot on five, erase these lines and count on ready let's count on three times ready 
We put five in our heads or five on the number line. Five, six, seven, eight. So five plus three plus five is eight. Okay. Let's do another example. Two plus sign. So this time I'm going to use the number line. Um, maybe you think the hundred chart is easier. So let's find out. Oops. The bigger number is nine. You got it. Okay. So I'm going to find nine on the hundred chart and count on how many times? Two times. Ready? Nine, ten, eleven. So nine, two plus nine is 11. Awesome. Another example, four plus eight. Which one's the bigger number? Eight, you got it. So I'm gonna highlight that in yellow. And which number are we counting on by? Four, awesome. So I'm gonna take, erase this. I'm gonna find nine on the number, oops nine on the number line or you can put or eight sorry oh my goodness you need eight there we go eight in your head eight on the hundred chart eight on a number line so eight nine ten eleven twelve so i kept track of my fingers you could keep track of the jumps on your um charts too so eight plus four is 12. Okay, awesome. So which number should we always start with when we're doing counting on? What, which number, grade twos? The largest number, and why? It's way easier to put the bigger number in your head and just count on smaller numbers. So now it's time for you to go and practice the count on strategy.